With Square Invoices, you can request payments for goods or services by sending in an unlimited number of invoices. But before we start sending invoices, we'll want to make sure our items are all set and our inventory levels are acceptable. So first what we'll do is we'll go into our item library from our dashboard and let's scroll down to our classic tee. This classic tee has 90 physically on hand, but only 29 available to sell. Each of these variations have their own inventory. We can see the full inventory, 15 for our small variation. All 15 are available to sell. But our extra large, the 15 that we physically have on hand, only nine are available to sell. That's because six of those are committed via an invoice that was sent out on October 9th. That quantity of six was added to an invoice at a customer's request. They have not yet paid for that invoice, so the invoice inventory is being held. It's committed. The inventory will properly settle and remove six from the stock on hand once the invoice is actually paid for. So with that being said, we still have nine of those available to sell. So Square will always keep your inventory in track, whether it's sold in person, over the phone, or via an invoice.